half an hour. Allegra Clark voices Lori. And there's a lot of voices in here. Yuri chan. A lot of voices we know. Uh, and good morning, sleepyhead. Uh, you were sound asleep. Class is over? The teacher kept giving you dirty looks. Duh. You slept through the whole class. I'm Kisaragi. Tell me, Kisaragi. Ah, I'm Sawatari. And I'm... Fuyusaka-san, right? I heard the teacher trying to call on you. Really? Oh, I didn't notice. <sighs> I've barely even started my high school life. And this is how I make a first impression? Okay, our legs are like super skinny. And hers are not. But they look the same. <laughs> this is kind of weird. <laughs> okay, you. Nice to meet you. You too, Kisaragi-san. Call me Usami. Weird nickname, but I'm used to it. In that case, you can call me Iori. Yeah, her ankles are really tiny. First name basis, I'm Miwako. Kisaragi is Morgana. Where'd you go to middle school, Usami-chan? Oh, uh... You know, nowhere special. Kind of far away, though. I hear it. Huh. Sorry, I have to ask. Usami-chan. Yeah? You and Goto-senpai, are you close? Goto? Nah, not really. Why? Well, he's awfully popular here at school. Seriously? That guy? Jeez. So that's how it is. There's a fish? Where? I saw you two talking in the hall earlier. Yeah, uh... Don't worry. He's not my type. Just an acquaintance. I see. Go, oh, get the damn fish! Thanks, Jack. Huh? Your forehead is red. Well, she was sleeping on the desk. Oh, um... I kind of bumped into someone. Now the rest of your face is red. Huh? I wonder why. Well, uh... The guy I ran into is kind of cute, so... Jeez, I feel awkward just thinking about it. Sounds like love at first sight. Really? Definitely. It was a destined encounter. You two are meant to be. Um, you think so? Maybe. <laughs> yeah, I'm kind of feeling that too. Go back to the robots, please. I know, it's kind of like... Shall we walk home together? <laughs> I'd love to hear more about this boy you met. Uh, I wouldn't. Um... You're welcome to join us, Usami-chan. There's a new crepe shop we could stop by. Crepes? I'm hoping this is just like yeah, initial I'm exposition. Down. Let's do it. Yeah, this is this is definitely uh, testing my anime limits. <sighs> you sure yawn a lot. Are you a night owl? Not really. It's Gets better. Just... I'm giving it time. I'm giving it time. I keep having strange dreams. They keep me up at night. I'm gonna give it time. What kind of dreams? It's hard to remember the details, but last night I was surrounded by flames like a burning city. This huge shadow started coming for me. And then I woke up. Uh Here here is here was my deal. Here's my deal. I'm going to play this until noon. I'm going to give it like the morning stream. I was told that the game gets really good. And if you're not hooked by three hours, it's not going to be for you. So I'm going to, I'm going to give, I'm going to give it until noon. And if I'm not feeling it at that point, we're going to play Witcher for the rest of the day. So that's, that's what we're doing, but I'm going to give it time. I'm, I said, I'd give it a try. We're going to give it a try. Oh. Is it lunchtime yet? Still out of it. I see. 
<laughs> what is this? My heart is racing. I wish I could have talked to him more. He wasn't wearing our uniform, was he? Maybe he's from a different school. Okay. Jesus. Jeez, that door was impossible to open. How old is this place? Let's go check on the nurse again. <laughs> Don't break the door. I didn't. Our school's pretty old. They were working on a new building for this year. But I heard construction was delayed. Okay. I think we'll be moving to the new one next month. Sure hope so. This place is a dump. I heard it was built during the war. Whoa. That means it's over 40 years old. Isn't your class next door, not Chun? Don't when does the creepy it. bear start Can't killing them? Smiling faces. <laughs> you know, <this> <laughs> yes, she's a good friend. The three of us have known each other since grade school. Natsuna-chan, this is Usami-chan. Last name, Kisaragi. And I'm Natsuno Minami. Nice to meet you. Oh, who is this? Minami-san. There you are. Busted. What are you doing in someone else's classroom? The teacher told you to prepare for the next class. Yeah, I know. Oh, right. You know that cat we were talking about? I saw it. Really? Where? I hope you're memorizing these names. Outside I, the science room. Um. Minami-san. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. I think I know that kitty. It has black fur with a white belly, right? You've seen it too, Miwa-chan? All the time. Dang. No fair. I haven't seen it yet. Dang. So it's behind the science room, huh? That's it. I'm gonna go looking. Hmm. Guess that nap did her some good. Anywhere. Where could it be? Oh! I found you! Hi, kitty! It's Letho. Hi, Letho. My what weave and waifu senses are going crazy. Here? Nice. Huh? Where'd it go? But why? Don't act like you don't know. It's Kurabe-kun, with Amiguchi-kun. We have something here. Amiguchi-kun, this isn't like you. Just listen, okay? This is a first for me, too. Whoa! You feel it, right? Whoa! I want to pursue this with you. Oh my god. Please. I don't know. It's just... Huh. Fuyusaka-san? <laughs> What is she doing here? I... Uh, mm -hmm. I think as long as you love each other, it's okay. <laughs> what? Don't mind me! Bye! Wait! There seems to have been a misunderstanding. <laughs> me and this guy? Dating? <laughs> That's rich. <laughs> Sorry for the confusion. We were just talking about something. Yeah, the strange dreams we've been having. Dreams? So, what are these dreams? Well, lately, it's been a lot of crazy stuff. Different every time. I don't even think they're in chronological order. But they do seem related. Hmm. Weird thing is, same goes for this guy. It's like we're seeing the same stuff. The more he tells me, the more I think it all lines up. Makes you think our dreams are connected. Oh, wow. Thank, thank you so much for the suggestion on that. That sounds so great. Um, awesome. Phenomenal. Maybe we've just seen too many movies. 
I guess we do have that in common. We first met at that video rental joint, after all. Still, I can't help but think it's something else. Like, I don't know, telepathy? If not that, maybe it's a vision of the future. The future? Anyway, I'm just saying. Whenever we dream this stuff, we should compare notes. Hmm. I know it sounds crazy. Do you believe us? Well, actually... I'm more surprised to hear that's all it was. Cause I thought... Hmm, class is starting. We can talk more later. Well, let's go, Fuyusaka-san. So you got debated. The, sto the story doesn't get better. No, I've had, I've had a lot of people tell me the story gets cool, which is why we're doing it. Oh Lord, what is this? Beginning of the end. Oh, here we go. Okay, cool. I I can get behind that name. All right, all right. Wait, what? We're here again? Why are they naked? Because apparently when they transport into the robot, their clothes don't go with them. Because it's a game! in some places. You're in a second generation Sentinel. It weighs around 2,200 tons. With that kind of weight, it can end up crushing its own components if it collapses. This big robot looks so tough. Is it really that useless if it falls over? Don't let your guard down. We have another wave of D-forces inbound. You keep talking about them like that. What are these D-forces? Yet the roses Kaiju's. in her hair get transported. They're the Kaiju. That's them. Stop trying to They're logic my nudity, friends. That's why they attack every terminal that has a connection to it. If they manage to reach the mainframe, this city will be wiped out. But we can't stay on the defensive forever. With so few of us, we could never sustain it. Go Instead, get the damn fish. I'm working on terminal's it. internal defenses, a specialized program. That puts up an impenetrable shield around the area. The D-forces would be completely locked out. That's got to be the Aegis system Ms. Morimura was talking about. But Go get the damn fish. To use? We're only using it to buy time. How do we activate it? Whichever one of you is closest, move to the D-forces invasion point. Invasion point? You mean where the kaiju are all trying to get to? Yes. The terminal sits directly below that point. Make your way towards the terminal, which is the invader's target. Move from the menu. Okay. I've got to do this. There? Number 15, moving out. That's where you send the signal to the terminal 300 meters underground. Either of your access IDs should be capable of activating it. And that'll fix it? That's enough to get rid of all the kaiju? No, it won't be that simple. The defense systems have a long startup. We'll need to buy enough time for Aegis to initialize. Until it activates, our mission is to keep the D-forces away from the terminal. Power defense. We'll try. Warning. Dymos signatures identified. Enemy in range. Preparing to intercept. The apocalypse is Kaukauna. <laughs> you must protect the terminal until the self-defense system Aegis is activated. Damage to the terminal is in the top left of the screen. Okay. Switch pilots with left and right. I 
Take it out. Back. Ah. Okay. Enemy front range. Okay. Can I blow my own guys up? That's it. Got it. They're down. Aegis activation confirmed. This area is now protected. Are your sentinels still operational? Mine's doing okay. I can still fight. Who's there? Are you fighting? You're in a sentinel. You're going to tell me who you are, now. I believe that's sentinel number 12, Okino's machine. I'm Takatoshi Hijiyama, and this is my sentinel. Takatoshi Hijiyama, you were with Okino-kun before. I've come to save the human race. Leave this region to me. Okay. He cut off his comms. I found his sentinel's location, but it's a ways from your position. He's not gonna try taking them all on by himself, is he? Hey, Broken. I'll move to rendezvous. You two should keep going towards the next combat Well, here comes zone. Mr. Modest. I know, right? Oh, wait. Which way is the next zone? It's this way. Follow me. We made it. Cool. So what happened with Phasmophobia? I had a light turned off, candles lit, and ready for you to play it in VR, but it seems to never happen. Since you're back to anime, will you finally finish playing V3? No. And I will probably... Uh, I don't know if we're going to do Phasmophobia. We'll see. I would like to do it sometime, though. So we'll figure it out. Oh, God. Wait. Oh, no, it's just him. Okay. Sure. Oh, this is... I think this is the badass chat. I think this is this is the cool one. <sighs> My name is Chad Yokonuzu. What's so. up? Looks like they're starting to panic down there. The sooner I'm out of here, the better. 1944? That's weird. Someone changed the shifter's access key, huh? That me. Not that it matters. Carry yourself. Huh? So, you came after me, Hijiyama-kun. This has to be some misunderstanding. You can't be a spy, can you? Hmm. Sounds like the professor, all right. Oh. Oh, I'm moving. Okay. Why did you run off? The military's looking for you. They think you stole some kind of intel. But you're the professor's daughter. You can't be a spy. It doesn't make sense. Sorry to break it to you. I'm not his daughter. The real Kiriko Doji is still over in Tokyo. What? But the whole spy thing's kind of a stretch. I don't need to steal any secrets on the Sentinels. I'm the one who built them, after all. Nani. I'm not sure I believe this. You built them? Yeah, that was me. I drew up the designs in an editor. Then I just had to send the order into an automated factory. But that's... No, you're probably just confused, that's all. I even implanted the linking component into your head. Though you wouldn't remember, of course. Anesthesia and all. When you came to the factory, you said you were there on behalf of the professor. It was as good a cover story as any. Sounds like dead sec to me. If you're not the real Kiriko, then... Then who are you? You wouldn't believe me if I told you. Or maybe... This really isn't about who I am. 
Maybe it's just about what you feel towards me. I, uh, <clears throat> oh my. You're kind of a simple guy. There's something about you, though. What are you even saying? I'm saying I'm gonna miss you. But my key just finished decrypting. <gasps> so, that's it. This is goodbye. <clears throat> Kiriko-san? She vanished? That's impossible. His life just got flipped, turned upside down. Oh my. It was barely a moment. She can't have had time to run into the mountains. Bro, did you not... What? Where did Kiriko-san go? Oh, someone's coming. Oh, he's the one who snuck into the factory. There's something fishy about him. Don't do but it, chat. If he's working with her, then... He might know where she's gone. I'll hide behind a tree and see what he's up to. Oh, get the damn fish! Damn it! I specifically said don't do it! Okay, I'm hiding. Tokisaka Shrine, huh? If this log is right, Okino just crossed over. Might still catch up if I'm fast. Coordinates read Sector 4 in the year 1984. It was you! Give it up. There's nowhere to run. Suspicious man. You know Kiriko Doji? Yeah. I knew it. Oh god. Though that wasn't actually her, of course. Is that really true? She said something along those lines, too. She, huh? Must have been pretty convincing, then. His real name is <laughs> Tsukasa Okino. He wears that stuff for his own reasons. What? Don't joke about that! You're just trying to confuse me! Hijiyama. So you're the spy. But there's no escaping me now. <sighs> what are you doing here? If I told you, you'd laugh in my face. Answer me, or I'll do more than laugh at you. I'm going to time travel to another era. No. Is that a joke? Okay. Or are you just insane? <sighs> what is the fish thing? Um, I play a game in the evenings called Hades. It's phenomenal, if you haven't checked it out. And there's fishing every so often that I miss. So we set up an alert. So if enough people do... Don't do it. So if enough people do the co-fish emote, then it triggers that alert, and then I remember to get the fish. So it's basically a way for chat to talk Co, to me. Co, get I... the damn fish! It's basically a way for chat to talk to me while I'm playing the game. Um, yeah. You're going to time travel, huh? Try a better story next time. This Kiriko Doji of yours? He did it himself just moments ago. Escaped from here into the future. I'm not falling for your lies. This is getting kind of cooler. I don't have time for this. Step back. I'm going after him. Well, so you do know where she went. Where? Show me. Your time travel. I'd like to see you try it. You don't say I didn't warn you. Well then. Chad has gone mad with power. It's true. Oh, it's that guy. <laughs> Starting to think he ain't gonna show. He knows you'd beat his ass watching him, son. Probably shitting his pants right now. Turned tail and ran, huh? Guess he didn't have the balls after all. Whoa, hold it. What? 
Yo, what is that thing? That looks... Is that like some kind of sandwich? I want one of those. Don't give me that shit. Nearly knocked my friggin' arm out of its socket. You want to apologize? Oh, did I hit you? Sorry about that. You're sorry? Sorry don't pay my goddamn hospital bills. So? I don't have money, if that's what you're after. Wait, Wajima-san. I heard about him. People have been talking about this guy. He's the one who's been snatching all the jackets. The hell? Wait. Yeah. This guy's wearing one of our uniforms. Oh, so you know the guy who owned this. I don't have any relatives around. I'm basically homeless at the moment. So the clothes and the cash were a really big help. But you mugged the dude? A generous guy. Tell him I said thanks. Take care. That's it? Hey, don't you walk away. Okay. Come on. <gasps> My yaki soba pun. <gasps> I didn't even get a single bite. You just made a big mistake, punk. You got a problem with me, buddy? You're the one who's about to have a problem. You heard him, boys. Sick him. Pow! Sing! Zap! Stop! We're sorry! Look, we'll get you another snack, man! I've got no mercy for people who waste food. Especially Yaki Soba Pon. What the hell happened? I thought you called me up for a fight, Wajima. Someone want to tell me what I missed here? And who are you? A friend of theirs? I'm Nenji Ogata from Sakura High. I didn't ask you to fight my battles, pal. Let's fight! Wait, it's you. You're that jacket snatcher. Uh, Hijiyama or something. Takatoshi Hijiyama. At your service. I told them I didn't need the help. It's so funny hearing, like, they English pronunciation of Japanese name. Takayoshi Hijiyama. What's up, man? Wouldn't take no for an answer. Yeah, I'll bet. Hey, Nenji Ogata. What's up? Drop the tough guy act already. I could say the same thing. Don't go picking fights you can't win. I've heard enough, douchebag. And you owe me a fight. VA's not bad, though. It's actually been pretty good so far. Wait, really? Come at me. Seriously? Well, you're gonna regret it. Come at me. Bring it. Or <laughs> talk to what this guy. <laughs> the... Well, look at this. I guess you fit right in here in the 80s. Here, I figured I'd have to check up on you. What? I know that voice. And that face. Wait. Oh, no. I came for a fight, and that was... I'm getting one. Out of my way, damn it! Oh, here we go again. Oh. Looks like it's almost dawn. This is about where Bully! I saw him. What's up, Seth? He has to be close by. That bastard kicked like a horse. Pretty tough for a thug. Clearly dead. You must had me for a moment there. Looks like it's locked. This can't be true. Can it? Was the Kiriko Doji I knew really a man? This Tsukasa Okino? Professor Doji led the Sentinel Project for our efforts in the war. His daughter, Kiriko-san, came along with him, but... 
What does it mean if this isn't her? How did I end up playing this? A very large amount of people have asked me to play this, which is why I'm checking it out. I'm giving it until noon to see if it hooks me or not. It's been, been it's been a little weird so far, um, but the VA is good. The story seems to be picking up and uh, we'll see where it goes. 